Alright, so this is going to be a review on my TMC AVS. Um, this is set up for my Ranger Regiment kit, uh, 2018 75th Ranger Regiment kit. So, I guess let's get started. Uh, it's a TMC base AVS and multicam. On the front, I've got a first spear M4 mag shingle. I got my EPA mags in there. And I've also got my Milsom West Tourniquet, rubber banded onto the front. I've got my name tape. I've got my PTT rubber banded on. And I've got a zipper kind of insert thing for my admin pouch. Um, it's kind of easier than Velcroing it, especially when you need to be quiet. Um, moving on to the side here, I have two Eagle V2 frags and multicam. Um, I just have, if I can get this open, EG67 grenades, that's what I kind of use them for, or for other random stuff, um, because my field does not allow sound grenades anymore. And then I have a Eagle 100 round nutsack pouch, um, and this I kind of just keep, like, extra magazine, BBs, um, I'll, keep, I'll keep an extra battery in there. Kind of whatever. And then moving on to the other side. Uh, left counter buns. I have a Eagle Embitter V2 in multicam. And that is housing my both dang radio. Um, I've got just the both dang radio extended battery pack and a um, I think it's a dual band 42 inch antenna. I'll close this back up real quick here. And then I have a Eagle V2 M4 pouch. Just holds two magazines there. It's a little bulky on the side. Um, if you're trying to keep your arms down, but it works. And then moving on, I have a Eagle Industries, uh, I believe this is the V2 IFAC uh, multicam. This just kind of holds all the stuff I need for injuries that could take place on the airsoft field. Got, open this here. got ace bandages, got foot powder for uh, longer events, and uh, especially for one coming up this summer. Got another Millsome West tourniquet, uh, antibacterial cream. Moleskin, um, bandages and stuff like that, and ibuprofen, stuff like that. And then, moving on to the rear. So I have a, I used to run a Smapple Gear Assaulters zip-on panel, um, but I am now running a custom Moly back panel with pouches on it. So uh, it's a TMC zip-on Moly panel. Um, it's it's so you can swap out panels easily like everything on here comes off with the zip on and I guess these are pretty rare nowadays. I haven't Hadn't heard of them until I actually acquired this uh, From a guy in my group, but on the back I've got another Eagle nutsack pouch Don't have anything in there right now. I'll probably just carry smokes uh, batteries snacks stuff like that um, Then I have a Eagle GB pouch I've only got like one magazine in there right now. I'll probably hold water on that as well as just kind of any extra stuff. And then I got two Eagle RLCS bangers. Uh, those will hold smoke grenades for when I play events where pyro is allowed. And lastly, in the inside of the harness, I have the Cry 6x9 plate pouches. Um, and inside of the plate pouches, I have some custom-made foam um, replica side plates. Just kind of made of like duct tape and stuff like that. But they, they work, they keep it rigid. Um, that's pretty much it. And I do have uh, I do have my PTT wired through shoulder here because I used to run uh, my radio and emitter back on the side where my IFAC is. But... 
Um, after I acquired the IFAC, I put it here, and now I have to run the radio up front. Also because I will be going as a team leader for the next Milsom West event. So I'll need that easy access. But yeah, that has been a, uh, an overview of my TMC AVS. Set up for a Roberts Ragnar's 75th Ranger Regiment impression kit.